Well, for once, I might be speechless. So you guys know I have talked a lot about appreciating the moment that you're in. And we have worked hard as a team. You guys have worked hard as a team for this moment. This is your moment. It is not by chance that you are here today. So I want you to look around, look around at this team and know that you have earned it. You have earned your place in the room. You've earned this moment. You have earned your place in history. You were part of a first. Doesn't come along very often. Once in a career, maybe. But we are all part of something incredibly special, the first launch of Artemis. The first step in returning our country to the moon and on to Mars. What you have done will what you have done today will inspire generations to come. So thank you. Thank you for your resilience. You know, I said at the pretest briefing, the harder the climb, the better the view. We showed the Space Coast tonight. What a beautiful view it is. So congratulations. So we got a couple of traditions here in launch control. And the first one is when you're in the position for the first time, you get a tie cutting. And so I have my launch director scissors. And I'm going to get my tie cut by a couple of legends that are here. And then anyone who wants their tie cut will be making the rounds in the firing room. You got your console chiefs, if they want to do it, that's fine. If you want me to do it, you might have to wait a little while, but I'll stay all night if I have to. It'll be my pleasure to cut ties. So I'm going to get, going to take care of mine, and then I have one other presentation that I want to make this evening. This is Charlie Blackwell Thompson, Artemis One Launch Director. She just got her tie cut. That is a tradition here at NASA. We just got to hear her talk to the team. And one thing that really stuck out to me that she said is that they've really earned their place in history. We're coming up on Solar Array Deploy. Let's go on to Leah. <laughs> 